Sorry for not posting last week. I did have uh, something I wanted to put together and it just did not it did not come together. <laughs> so that's okay. And I'm like a day late, but better late than never uh, for this week. So I am unboxing our Boxy Charm by Ipsy this month. Uh, what is this month of March? Oh my gosh, March is already here. This year has flown by so fast. And I don't know if anybody else is feeling this, but literally it has been one thing after another. Like literally, something happens, something major happens, something major happens, and it's just like, it's only, it just hit March. It just hit March. 2024 needs to slow down its roll because I'm about over it already. Um, but enough of the rant. <laughs> Let's see what we got in our boxy charm. All right, so. The theme this month is Rewrite the Rules, Wear Too Much Blush, Make the First Move, Get a Mismatched Manny. Uh, this month, March to your own beauty beat without, with botanical skin care, must have makeup, and a nature-inspired palette from women-led brands who inspire us to rewrite, rewrite the rules every day. So that is for the month of March. The very first item I see... I'm excited. I love this brand. Uh, it's from Glow Recipe. This is the Strawberry BHA Pore Smooth Blur Drops. Okay. Uh, it says, uh, blur pores instantly, controls excess oil, and visibly reduces pore size with this all-in-one treatment and primer. Packed with a mattifying blend, blah, blah, blah. A whole bunch of stuff I can't pronounce. To smooth skin's texture. Uh, evenly spread a pea-sized amount and a gently pat on to clean toned skin, AM and PM to target excess oil and refine the appearance of pores. Um, follow with moisturizer. So, this I actually might give to my daughter because it does like talk about uh, oily skin and I have, I do have pores, but I have more dry skin. So this is, if this is geared towards oily skin, then I'm just going to pass this on to my daughter. I don't want to try and hold on to it, especially if she can get better use out of it, out of it than me. Um, so excited for the brand. I'm glad that this is in here. Kind of a bummer that it's not like targeted directly towards my skin type, um, but it, it'll still get like good use. Okay, the next item is from Sonage. This is the Vitality Nourishing Facial Oil. Um, Instantly radiates sensor. Blah, blah. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. Instant radiance sensory oil blend. Let's see. On cleansed skin, massage a few drops of vitality nourishing, nourishing facial oil on face, neck, and degligé until absorbed. Doesn't say it's like targeted for certain things. Uh, French heritage since 1994, non-toxic, American beauty made, cruelty free, SPA grade. Well, that is fantastic, but it doesn't tell me that it does anything specific. It's just a, like it's just an oil. Anyways, this is what it looks like. Looks like it's got like a little pump here. I'll have to do some research on this. See uh, what exactly it does. But if you guys have heard of this brand or use this product and you already know, let me know down in the comments below um, what exactly this is for other than just being in a face oil. Okay, moving on. Oh, we got a lipstick. Okay, this is from Mich Michelle, I M I S C H O Beauty. Okay, and this is in the shade. <laughs> I think they literally try to like tongue tie me with over half of this stuff. I cannot pronounce. So it's Ijama, Ijama, I J A M A. I'm not. Re I'm not really sure. Um. 
pretty. Oh, that's pretty. That looks like a pinky new. Oh, let's do a swatch. That is very. Oh, oh, that's pretty. I want to trade. Okay, I am going to take this off and put this on, and I'll be right back. It is literally so close to my my lip shade. Just gives it a little bit more color. That is so buttery smooth. Oh my gosh. Like, this can be like a top favorite of mine. Oh, look at that shade. It's so beautiful. Oh, I think I just found a new favorite. And yes, this sucker is still here and it is annoying the crap out of me. I have been using, what is it, some kind of like scar treatment at night to try and get rid of this and it is not going away guys. Like this zit really did a number on my face. Um, I'm actually not really even like zit prone. It only happens during that time of the month. This one left a little scar right here. That one kind of bugged me. Um, these are kind of scarred right here, but this one's like really, really bad. So if you guys have anything that can like lighten that up, make it go away completely, I would really appreciate that. Um, but back to the lipstick, it is beautiful. I love the shade. It's just mwah, chef's kiss. Okay, moving on, we got two items left. This is from Riddle. A roll on fragrance now you guys know and I think I had another fragrance before they take a chance when you put a fragrance in a box because everybody's nose <laughs> is so different like what smells good to you might not smell good to me what smells good to me might not smell good to you and um, I don't know like the last one I didn't like I don't smell anything right away. Let's put this on like a paper towel because I do not want to put it on, especially if I'm not going to like it. Am I missing something here? If not. I kind of smell something and kind of don't. Do I have to push the ball in a little bit more? I really, okay, I don't want to put this on. All right, we're gonna do it. Well, it came off easy on the hand. It's not terrible. Would not be like, oh, let me grab the Riddle perfume. No. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about it. Like I said, this is a chance. So for those of you that get this perfume in your box, I hope you love it. There's a chance that you might not. I'm holding my hand up like you can see. Eh. It's okay. Like I said, not terrible. Not something I would like definitely reach for. Maybe I'll give it to a coworker. <laughs> We'll see. We'll see. It's kind of got like a a musk, a hint of vanilla, like very, very fine hint of vanilla. But it's definitely like a musk scent. I don't know. Okay, moving on. The last item is from, oh nice, Wonder Beauty. Uh, this is the Trailblazer Eyeshadow Palette. Very nice. Let's see what the colors are inside. Alright, this palette is really, really pretty. Oh, I am attracted to that green right away. Look at that. Very nice. Very pretty palette. Oh. But... 
the last time I used a Wonder Beauty palette, it kind of made my eyes really itchy. Um, so I don't know if it was like that particular palette or if I was allergic to something in their formula. I don't really know. So I'm, I don't really want to dive into it. Does that sound I mm, um, Yeah. The colors are pretty. The colors are very, very pretty. I, I could definitely use those. Um, but because it did break my eyes out, um, I am not going to swatch it. I'm actually going to pass it on. Um, just because I don't want to take the chance. Because they did really itch last time. It was extremely uncomfortable. Uh, but I do love that. Like Wonder Beauty has um, a mascara that I love that is like amazing. Um, but we're going to pass on the palette. Okay, so really quickly, let's go over this box. So we got the eyeshadow palette, which has beautiful colors. Um, we got the Glow Recipe Drops, which are, uh, or sorry, excuse me. Yeah, the Pore Smooth Blurring Drops, which is a great product. Um, we got the Facial Oil. The Lipstick, which I will say has to be my absolute favorite product out of this out of this box. Even if I got nothing else, this would solid make me happy. <laughs> um, and then we got the the perfume. So I don't know. I feel like I've gotten better boxes where I have loved everything. And for me, this box, maybe just because it's not really, I feel like some of the products I can't use or just aren't geared towards me or my skin. Um, so I'd have to say that this box is kind of eh. Does that make sense? It's kind of eh. Eh. This month. <laughs> Alright guys. But that is it. Let me know down in the comments below. What did you think of this box? Um, is there anything in this box that you are looking forward to getting? Uh, I would love to know. So that is it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please give this video a big old thumbs up. I'd really appreciate it. And I will see you on the next video.